First things first, shout out to Wrenching with Kyle, Kyle Fraser. Um, big shout out to you, mate. Cheers for watching the videos. We welcome back to the shop, guys. So on a hot day like this, what do we all do? We want to clean the car, don't we? So I've just uh, cleaned the car. Um, surprisingly, I went to Tesco's. Let me just show you this. I didn't hold up much hope for it. Um, it's absolutely awesome. Um, I used about three capfuls of this in a little bucket of water, and it's washed the whole car. Um, and it just kept foaming up. You know, it's a bit like a sea foam. Um, so that was really cool. Um, I've done a bit of a cheat wash today. I've just washed it with that, and then I've hit it with the Demon Shine and a microfiber. So that's the, that's the wash I did after we come back from camping, just to get rid of all the road grime and salt. Obviously, you don't want to leave it on the paintwork. Just show you. Um, I like washing the car, and again, I don't like washing the car because you get to see all the new scratches and stuff. But it's pretty clean. Yeah. Okay, should we go and have a look? But, 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 but you have to wait, wait, wait for it a lot. All right then. Okay. Yep, I'm just going to come in. It's just in the shed. A couple of things I want to show you. Um, first thing is, if you've seen my other video, um, this. It's absolutely quality. Um, once you get the specific data onto it, um, the software, it's a really good tool. You can do pretty much anything with this tool. And you can put up to four four softwares on there. So obviously I've got the Honda one because I got that free when I bought this. But you can put four softwares on there, so that's really cool. Uh, this cloth was from Tesco's again. It's a fluffy microfiber. It's called for polishing and rubbish. Um, all the fluff comes off on it and it actually doesn't dry doesn't dry the car like a normal cloth does. things I want to show you guys, a couple of tools. Um, inside the trolley, oh, see there, these to go on my uh, Renault Clear, 1.816 valve. Not 1.8 anymore. Anyway, in the trolley, this is pretty cool. This was my granddad's um, torque wrench. It's a Bedford torque wrench. So this is probably older than me, made in England, with a uh, pat number there. This is really cool and it still works. I've tested this with a brand new uh, Clark torque wrench and it's still in calibration. That's pretty nice to have one of my granddad's tools. Next thing I want to show you is these. These are McAllister from B&Q. I've sorted the camera out now. These are McAllister from B&Q. Uh, these are called grip drives. You get this nice little box. Uh, they're for its drive. So you get a 10, 12, 13, 14, 15, 17, and a 19. And they're a nice little case. And they got these extra pieces inside to help grip onto the nut what you're trying to get out, or the bolt. So I've used these a few times and they're really cool. So I like those. Those are £25 in the shop. I got them on eBay for £12. Some of them are selling them brand new. So that was pretty cool. I'll round off this video, guys. The Foxwell gets a thumbs up from me, highly recommended. The Demon Shine for a quick wash and um, instant shine just to protect it. This stuff is uh, really good, doesn't leave any white residue, which is cool. This stuff has really surprised me. Uh, this is from Tesco's Shampoo with Wax. That gets a thumbs up. And these get a thumbs up from me. These are really cool in a nice little case. Also, as you know, this trolley gets a thumbs up. This gets a thumbs up. Uh, this is my spring compressor. That gets a thumbs up in the shed. Those screwdrivers get a thumbs up. They're Halfords Advanced. They're a really good set of screwdrivers. Another tool I want to show you while we're looking at tools. Draper, uh, suitable for detecting engine noises with uh, such as piston slap, worn gear bearings, damage valves and water pump failure. So this is a um, mechanics um, stethoscope can't remember the name there these are really good but be careful because they're so sensitive um, it really hurts your ears so don't whack the probe on anything when you're using this but for for water pumps i found water pumps and bearings that are faulty this is really good and it's better than using uh you know you can put something on your ear and listen through but this is really cool 
a really good tour. Yeah, just a is. quick video, guys, um, today. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.